Good morning. It is, what day is it, Catherine? It's Friday. It's Friday morning, and we are atop the Piazza Venezia, a huge building that uh, is really one of the most magnificent buildings we've seen in our trip to Rome here today. And we just want to show you the view that, that we have from atop this building. Naturally, we start filming you know, um, some kind of a helicopter decides to go over, but this is Rome. And you're looking out uh, from the view that we have here atop this magnificent building. It was just a stroke of luck that we found this building and decided to come. Uh, you're looking out uh, to the north of us, uh, towards where Trevi Fountain is and the uh, president of Italy's uh, residence. We filmed from there yesterday. We're looking over Rome um, from this, uh, from atop this this palace that was uh, built by Pope Paul II, and uh, you're looking out now to the west. See that dome off on the horizon? That's the Vatican. And this uh, Piazza Venezia has two bronze quadrigas. Oh, there's that. You want to see a helicopter? There's a helicopter. Isn't that a thrill? Um, the uh, quadrigas are the bronze statues. That one is uh, called Freedom. Four horses and a winged uh, soldier eh. on top. Andy. And then this one is called Unity. Four horses and a woman. A uh, winged angel, I guess. Eh, now, we look around here, and I'm going to come all the way around, and we're going to walk over here. We're going to walk towards Freedom, and we're going to come over to the other side of this building. This was just a stroke of luck that Catherine and I came to this building, but we look out, and it's a little sunny on this side, but there's the uh, Teatro di Marcello, which was the second theater in Rome to be built with mace out of masonry. We're looking out over the Jewish ghetto which one of the 16th century popes decided to build walls all around the Jewish ghetto in Rome. They were torn down about a century later. Uh, these buildings out here, this building you're looking at right now was designed by Michelangelo. Um, over there, to beyond it, if you can see where my finger is pointing, that's the uh, Circus Maximus, uh, where they used to have chariot races. This is called Palatine, Palatine Hill and uh, uh, beautiful grounds. And you're looking right now, you're seeing the Colosseum. The Colosseum uh, used to seat 50,000 people. And there were bloody battles between gladiators and wild animals over there. And then down below, you just can't quite see all the markets of Trajan, which is one of the favorite spots that we found most interesting today. And then, my travel companion, there's Catherine. And you're wondering, why doesn't Catherine get a chance to talk? Well, Catherine doesn't enjoy speaking on video. Yep, and so she just would rather have a piece of duct tape over her mouth, I guess. That's And Catherine can say the one word she said yesterday was... Ciao. Ciao, and that's all she'd like to talk about today. So, anyway, here you have the, the second installment of our video blog from Roma. Uh, let's see, what else did we do yesterday? We had uh, we came back to our room. We were thoroughly exhausted. We took about a four-hour nap. And then we went out. Uh, we went down and we talked to the, uh, the uh, desk clerk, Carlo. And Carlo said, yes, go down the street. There's, the, there's a place where you can get the pizza and a salad and all that good stuff. But we were a little bit hungry. So we went down. And <laughs> turns out he was sending us to a, an Irish pub in Rome. And, but the food was uh, uh, delicious. Uh, Catherine had a caprese salad. Uh, the mozzarella is absolutely nothing but fresh mozzarella in Rome. And uh, I had a sardine pizza. No, it wasn't sardine. It was uh, anchovy, an anchovy pizza. And then we had uh, gelato and sorbetto. And uh, we, we had some uh, cafe americano. And we just had a wonderful time. Took a nice stroll back, uh, the cool of the evening. It was marvelous, and we slept like stones. We were so tired yesterday. Well, anyway, that's it for today. Um, 
we have lots of sights to see. We're going to go over to the Coliseum next. We're going to wander through the grounds. We're going to go over to Palatine Hill, which is just absolutely beautiful. We've become keenly aware by getting up this high on the Piazza Venezia atop this wonderful 14th century building that was at one time Mussolini's headquarters, sadly, but that this was a mistake that we made that turned out to be a wonderful opportunity to see Rome from a high point, and we're so glad we did it. That's it for today for the video blog from Rome. We love you all. God bless you all. Ciao.